Hello and welcome back to Subnautica. We are in the uh, inactive lava zone. Um, in fact, we're so deep, I've just realised that uh, we are close to crush depth. Um, we're at a drop, so this may uh, result in bad things, but we'll see. Now we're good for a little while longer. So our main objective is to find kyanite. That's the reason we're here at the moment. Um, and then we can cart that back to the Cyclops and then see what we can build with it. Assuming we're going to have better luck now that we're in sort of the, the biome proper, as it were. Is that nickel ore? Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you. It should be like a blue gemstone jobby we're looking for. <laughs> you guys. You're like the sand sharks. So there we go, that's got to be it, right? Ugh. A delightful infected ray there. Come after me, cool. We need four of this bastard material uh, to, to get what we need. Let's see if we can. There we go. Take a wee while, it seems. But there's four straight away, so we can head back. But we'll get, we'll get all of it. We need it for, like every high-level upgrade seems to need it in some fashion. So there's lots of other materials here as well. So. Might be able to, hey buddy. Might be able to just stay here a while, you know. Not that it's, you know, particularly nice down here, but. Uh... <laughs> Alright. Ooh. The rays are getting chased. Yeah, well, I don't particularly enjoy it down here. It's not the worst biome I've been in. In fact, I think it's. Slightly, ever so slightly nicer than the Lost River at the moment. <laughs> at least I don't have a ghost leviathan literally up my house. Though I know there's uh, other beasties lurking further within. Hope you fuckers have left my cyclops alone. You right pain in the ass for that. You like scoop me up a wee bit as high as I can go and then let the charge take over. I'm in the wall. There we go. See, this uh, episode may be a little bit of a stomp back and forth, uh, as is as is tradition when the prawn suit is involved. It's all very stomp delicious, um, but the end result should be decent. Uh, and then we'll have to figure out how to go deeper. Because I'm hoping, cross your fingers, that we'll have all the materials down here that we'll need. The only exception is going to be stuff like uh, anything that is creep fine. Because um, we could potentially make polyaniline here and stuff like that. So we'll see. If there is something where I have to uh, trudge <laughs> back to base, I shall probably do that off camera again if I get time to save uh, that malarkey. Let's go over this way. Should be around the bend. We will uh, plug you in as well, as obviously we, fingers crossed, are going to have a way to charge without uh, too much trouble. If I've got to bring it in a little further to get it to charge, then that's what I'll do. But it should be plenty spicy where it is. It's literally over a lava flow. 
You don't really get much hotter than that. Oh, that was not the trajectory that's going to be healthy. There we go. There's like things, but it's just the smaller versions of the deep shrooms that I keep seeing that are like a texture against the wall. We just haven't clicked in yet. Yeah, piss off, mate. You dead? Nice, no, it's for me. You just learn your lesson. <laughs> I never let you forget it. Tell your friends. At least this thing's got a reasonable boost, even in the not upgraded fashion like this, it's still got a bit of a decent boost on it. Are you going to attack? Ooh, uh, it's going to be a bit tight. No, oh, you. Did you just piss off after that? Nice up there. Show you why you don't mess with me. Go out, aim something at you, and then miss. You teleport away. Bloody coward. <laughs> Not storage or upgrades. <laughs> Want to get in the damn thing? There we go. Will you let me get up this time? <laughs> he fired, but I got in just in time, I think. Yeah, he must have been underneath me. Open storage, just take out some kite light. I think some gold in there as well. The other bits I need. Seek fluid intake. Well, I certainly can do now. We got back in time for that. Got a bunch of that. I don't know, I keep pressing Y for inventory because we're playing in the long dark. <laughs> Vital signs stabilizing. Right, I need the wiring kit. Couple of these bad boys. We should hopefully be good to hey thermal reactor module that should help the battery stay charged while we're down here I don't know how fast it's going to charge them whether we can actually prove it's working but <laughs> plug that bad boy in Oh yeah, it's definitely working. Look at it go. Oh, well, you've got fucking slugs on it draining the energy again. Good check. Oh, it's charging up the Cyclops, that's why. They're prawn to you. Let's do check for slugs anyway. There we go. Kill ya. There we go. Got the bloody everywhere. Come here. I'm not letting you leave alive. <laughs> Maybe if I kill all in the area, the rest will get the sudden message. If only the little energy shield didn't use up so much energy, I could just keep that on and fry them once they came in. <laughs> I tend to just like turn it on at one point, see if it does like zap them all to this. Right, is the energy going up now? Seems to be, yeah. Got it pretty quick as well, to be fair. Nice. 
Right, depth modules. Mark III needs plasteel, lithium, and titanium. Lithium shouldn't be too hard to come across. I think I might actually have some of this titanium blocks around. Um, so that's good. Prawn suit. What do we get? Oh, yeah. We need three more kyanite for that. Prawn suit is probably the best bet to do first, at least. Got the suit to lithium. Just need the titanium. Might start getting damaged a little bit, but we can just take it out. Boop, boop. Of course, let's go find a titanium chunk. I don't know why I went down there. <laughs> and then it'll be good to go into the next area, and then we can do the Cyclops, can't we? He's a bit nicked. Oh boy. Give him a bit of a once over, shall we? This is why I brought spare batteries. <laughs> Because all of our stuff gets uh, a bit banged around. There we go. Right, let's look for suitable chunks. Eh? Yes, you're very interesting. Uh, I wish you would eventually die to my knife, but I'm assuming it's going to take a few whacks. Oh, that looks like it could be titanium E. Yeah. Like five of it, I think. So, just gonna have to drill this whole chunk and, and hope and pray. Four, yeah, we should get more than enough. We'll just take the whole thing out and then uh, go from there. Because that's also needed for the Cyclops' one as well. Need to check how much kyanite I've got actually. I know we've got a bunch, but I don't think it's enough for both. Is there still more of it? Or is that it? No, oh, okay, I was just drilling into thin air. <laughs> Alright, that was easy enough. Less of a struggle than I thought it would be. to zap me out right before I get there again, aren't you? Without doing that. There we go. Right. Let's make sure we got everything. So that, because that oh, poor thing might start getting a bit damaged when we take it out. So we can get five titanium and that from storage. Two, three, four, five. Three. What else was it? A couple of lithium, I think. Two lithium, I think we got some storage downstairs. Lithium is pretty common as a a chunk to mine, so we might be able to find some on the other chance. Yeah, we got a bunch of lithium. Let's check that's everything. I thought we were chugging the out right now. Although I guess if it's in the cyclops it shouldn't technically take damage, should it? Yes. I don't know, there we go, 1700 meters, that should be more than enough. I think it did get a little, either it got dinged when we were taking it up or it got dinged a little bit there. I don't think we can repair it from up here though. Can we like, repair its feet? <laughs> you think they have like some sort of repair function on here? What's the Cyclops' is one, just in case we do want to take this a little further? Mark 3 Plasti and 3 Kyanite, okay. We have enough Kyanite for that as well. Is there anything that's also useful for you? No, it isn't. It's just the thermal reactor that needs the Kyanite, which is good. Good, 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 good. Speaking of which... Yep, still going up. Well, we've solved that problem at least.
That is the main thing I wanted to get done this session was to get that upgrade in. And it looks like we can get the upgrades for everything else as well. Although, we're going to need a fuck ton more titanium. <laughs> Although, we might actually have just enough if we convert the metal salvage as well. Oh, yeah, look at that. Everything is coming up red. And we only need two lithium, which we have downstairs. We're going to be fully tricked out by the end of this. Three kyanite, and I think that is it. Yeah. yeah, I think we have just exactly three kyanite left. Yes, we do. Right, again, we're gonna have to be quick. It's gonna get crashing very quickly. Warning: maximum depth reached. Hull damage limit. There we go. Yeah, we, uh, there it goes, uncrushing. <laughs> Is it actually going to get back to full? Yeah, it looks like it. Well, there we go. We now have a uh, fully tricked out Cyclops and a pretty decent prawn suit as well. I don't think there's anything else we can get for the prawn suit in here, is there? No, we need the vehicle modification station, which we left at home, but I'm not too fast. Our prawn suit will do. Buddy. Come on then. You missed. Good job. Right, so let's stomp back to where we were and begin sort of exploring around that area. Speaking of which, actually, I've got three water bodies. Oh, it fires automatically, never mind. Well, that's fine. I can go and get some more water and food. I see you on there. Right next to my hatch is not the best place to, to hide. Me. Let's get some more water and. Yeah, there we go. Just so we don't have to go scurrying back. And we can supplement it with stuff that we can cook as we go. See if I can be new. Didn't like me shooting at him. <laughs> See, you're allowed to shoot at me, but I'm not allowed to shoot at you. Double standards these warpers have. No, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> 1700 is good, though. It means I just don't have to worry about how deep I'm going. I just have to worry about what's around me. So, yeah. I'll make it right. Yeah, I've got one med kit, it's not the greatest. So let me just uh, shut her up before she starts. Didn't upgrade the jump jet, which might have been a mistake, but I'm hoping it's just a smooth descent from here. Really? Um, I know it's going to get rough. Obviously, we're going into late game areas now, but um, hopefully, we can handle it. Should we stomp around the edge? This doesn't really matter. So, yeah, be the active lava zone next episode, I assume, or at least trying to find the fucking thing. Um, we have oh, okay. away from the mushrooms. <laughs> we have our map that we'll fill out as we go, but I don't know. You know how useful it's going to be. If he tells us we found the open area and not much else, um, I guess if we do stumble into the active lava zone, we'll be able to see on this map. So we'll know it when we find it. I'm assuming. And then we are sort of moving to the end game, I guess. 
I know there's a bunch of stuff to do before we get there. End game, I mean. Um, but at least we'll have a goal, we'll have some sort of direction. We'll not just be bumbling around. <laughs> Which is basically what we've been doing for the last 10,000 years. Um, but either way, I will end it here as we venture back towards the big open plane of scariness. That didn't work. Um, I'm not sure why that didn't work, because it hit me dead on. I even got moved by it. <laughs> didn't even damage me. Maybe he uh, doubted himself at the last second. Um, yeah, we'll end it here as I get back to the, uh, the main open area. There it is. So, thank you very much for watching. If you like my content, please do check out my other videos. And if you do, I shall see you there. Goodbye.